Hey, what's up, y'all? It's the Big Cousin Steve on that Nerf tip. Today, I got an unboxing and review of the Nerf and Strike Elite AccuStrike Falcon Fire. I'm gonna be 100 with y'all because you are my cousin. Um, I got I got some reservations about the Falcon Fire because to me it's looking like it's gonna be exactly like the Ion Fire, which I do like, but I'm not really expecting anything new about the blaster. And the darts, the AccuStrike darts, I don't know. I mean, maybe they're gonna be hella sick, but I do know that a lot of third company or third party companies make really accurate Nerf compatible darts, so. I don't know. So I don't know if, you know what I'm saying, these are going to blow me away or not. So, I mean, the blaster does look tight. So far, I'm happy with the purchase. So let's go ahead and dig into this thing, shall we? It's got these little stretchy little ties. I don't really need scissors or a knife or nothing. So far. Okay, the blaster's out. Okay, that's kind of clean. I'll set this to the side. All right, now let's see if we can get these darts out without the screen in joints. Oh, what's in the box? Oh, oh, instructions. Get these little darts out. They make it so hard to get darts out. Oh, okay. They're open. Okay, let's set these to the side. Now let's go get this look singled out. This quarantine one. This dart sick, so they gotta put it in quarantine. Okay, let's get rid of the box. Now I got this little thing. Oh, it just opened kind of like a little, like a snack. Like it just opened like a snack. It opened like a string cheese. Okay, then let's put this over to the side with the other darts. Okay, that's tight though. I'm already liking the uh, ergonomics of this thing. The handle's comfy, you know what I'm saying? And you know, okay, dry firing. Whoa, that's way comfier than the Falcon Fire, or than the Ion Fire, because the Ion Fire has that little whoop, that little handle thing always be messing up my knuckles. Don't be messing with the big cousin knuckles. I like that, no, that's comfy. Looks like you got a couple dart storages right here, and then that's a very nice place for a tactical rail because you can put another handle right there. You could put a little sexy little light, and I mean, it does kind of go with the modulus colors, so yeah, that's nice. I'm gonna go ahead and put some some darts in the little dart storage. Okay, that's pretty fresh, like. I like that it holds three, really, because one you can put one in here, but it comes with six. That's tight. If anybody from Nerf is watching, I appreciate that y'all doubled my darts. All right, let's open that breach. Okay, let's throw an AccuStrike dart in there, I guess. Push it back, close it. We are locked and loaded. All right, I'm going to go ahead and pick something to shoot at and see if it really is that accurate. I guess I'll just shoot at the elliptical. Wow. All right, it is a slow rate of fire because it only goes one at a time. Okay. The darts didn't go all crazy like elites. They just kind of went right down the center. You know what I'm saying? That's pretty tight. Okay. Nice. I got it for like 17, I think, which I would say is me overpaying, but you know what I'm saying? It's a new line, it, you know, it's got some hype on it. It's pretty tight. I like how the blaster looks. I think it's better than the Eye on Fire. I would recommend this because it's a cool blaster, but maybe when it comes down to like 13 or something, I'd say that's a good price. But for now, you know what I'm saying? I'm liking it. Ooh, and I know what y'all gonna say. Big cousin, you need to clean up your ooh -oo zone. I know, I know. I'm in the process of getting pegboard, so, ooh. I'm finna put my blasters up and it's gonna be cute. I'm trying to get some pegboard so I can just start do 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 put my blasters up. Then it's gonna look clean. And I already bought some spray paint. I think I'm gonna spray, well, I bought gold and spray paint. I think it's Krylon, 
but I don't know for sure. I'm glad I finally get opened this so I could play with it. Because <laughs> sometimes I buy stuff and I just let it sit because I ain't ready to make a review or, or whatever. And I like the unboxing and review. Sometimes it's tight to open it up and play with it for a little while, but I don't know. Man, I'm rambling. I'm really tired. I just got off of work and I'm so tired. Oh, and I failed my driver test today, so I'll be kind of, so I guess you could say I'm in a blue mood. Big cousin in a blue mood. Oh, it was so stupid though. Ugh. Like I straight choked. Like I, I would say I'm probably one of the best car drivers on the road. But for some reason during my driver test, like I got the gas and the brake mixed up. And so I kind of like scared some people and stuff. And the person who was doing the test, he said that he was scared for his life and stuff. But anyway, he said I could retake it in a week. So whatever. Hit the like button. Go ahead and share this video all around the world. Let's make it viral. Ooh. And uh, subscribe for more of that Big Cousin content. And I'll see you later. Ooh, ooh.